Hello, this is Space Daily News. Astra bounced back from last month's launch failure. With a groundbreaking success deploying satellites in Earth's orbit for the first time ever, the California company's two-stage launch vehicle 0009 lifted off from the Pacific Spaceport Complex on Kodiak Island on March 15. Just less than 9 minutes later, the 43-foot-tall rocket deployed its payload into their designated orbit 326 miles above Earth. It was a huge moment for Astra, which suffered a failure last month during its first-ever launch with operational payloads on board. Astra aims to break into the small satellite launch market in a big way with its line of cost-effective, easily transported and ever-evolving rockets. The company had conducted five orbital flights before today, four of them test missions from Kodiak. Astra reached orbit successfully on the most recent of those four test flights, a November 2021 mission. But the company stumbled on its next mission, its first with operational payloads on board. That flight, which carried four tiny CubeSats for NASA's purposes, lifted off from Cape Canaveral on February 10. Astra's LV-0008 mission performed well initially, but encountered two problems about three minutes into the flight, when its first and second stage separated. Payload fairing didn't deploy properly on February 10, and the rocket's second stage began tumbling shortly thereafter, and the satellites were lost. Astra investigators soon go to the bottom of both problems, instituted fixes, and prepared for a new mission. Mission 0009 rose into the Alaska sky smoothly and ticked off its early milestones as planned. Stage separation and fairing deployment went well, and the rocket's second stage cruised at the desired orbit with no apparent issues. Payloads was deployed successfully about 9 minutes after liftoff. This was Space Daily News. Stay tuned with us.